Dear Mr. President, in May 2017, uh, this House adopted a resolution in which uh, we expressed grave concern over your arrest and incarceration on fabricated politically motivated charges. We insisted on the need to ensure fairness, diligence and transparency during your trial. And after the abuse and hardship that you uh, suffered, you now address us as the democratically elected president of your country. It is indeed therefore a great honor to have you with us today. Zambia is a democratic model in Southern Africa and an example of a mature democracy for the whole African continent. In the current troubled geopolitical context, it is important that democratic forces nourish and further develop cooperation with each other. This applies especially for Africa, where we see the increasing influence of Russia and other malign players. Zambia is a long-term stable partner of the European Union and plays a key regional role. Our relationship is rooted in a spirit of mutual respect and cooperation. It is based on shared values of democracy, respect for the rule of law, human rights and rules-based multilateralism. We are well aware of the serious economic challenges brought on your country by the pandemic and exacerbated by the increased prices of fuel and fertilizers resulting from the Russian aggression <coughs> against Ukraine. The European Union stands ready to mitigate these consequences through the Global Gateway Africa Initiative and through reinforced political dialogue. This parliament fully supports your government in its endeavors to tackle your main challenges and priorities, notably the fight against poverty, encouraging economic recovery, the creation of decent jobs and the promotion of good governance. Dear President, the floor is yours. Thank you.